son just hollers, we're gonna die. Mama, please don't let me die. We are hearing more stories of survival from people impacted by Monday's tornadoes. Homes in Cherokee County were destroyed as people hunkered down inside them. 7 News reporter Nikel Smith talked with a mother who was inside her home when the tornado struck. Yeah, there's not much left of this home here in Cherokee County, but the family says they're thankful to be alive. My ears started popping like I was going up a mountain and all the insulation just was like snow. That's when Samantha Wisnett was inside her laundry room on West Diesel Drive with her three and six year old sons by her side. We just started sliding and um, it felt like an eternity, of course, but I'm sure it was just 45 seconds, maybe a minute. As an EF2 tornado devoured the house, she says she turned to her faith. So we stopped right where we were and we cried out to God. She says as soon as an escape seemed possible, they headed to the back door. I just couldn't get the door open and I heard, I was yelling for help. By that time, neighbor Jeremy George was rushing towards them. Their back door was locked. I heard them screaming, so I kicked the back door in as hard as I could. I don't even know how I kicked it in. We did, I just picked both the boys up and we took off running towards the house. Minutes away from their home, a family on Fairview Road in Cherokee County was also hunkered down. My wife and granddaughter, two great grandbabies, and my sister in law. Frankie Queen says they heard the sound other tornado victims always remember. The roof flew off the house, windows broke, and it's just, it's just amazing that we got out without anybody being injured. Communities are now cleaning up. A lot of their uh, framing and things had, had come across and hit our house. After a second tornado hit Cherokee County in recent weeks. It was very surreal. I turned around and looked at the house and I just couldn't believe we walked away. God was absolutely there with us. And the family says there has been an outpouring of love and support from the community. And for that, they are also very thankful. Reporting in Cherokee County, Nikhil Smith, 7 News.